hello guys welcome you all to the channel so in this video we will be discussing more about bluehost what is bluehost and why you should choose bluehost as your favorite hosting service basically i'm using this bluehost for last one year an experience and i had a very great experience with bluehost so i will be sharing all the things with you along with that i will be sharing all the step-by-step -step guides like how exactly you can start your blue host hosting account and for that what option you have to choose on a screen for a better experience agar aap hamare is channel pe naye hain to subscribe ke button ko click aur bell icon ko hit karna mat bhuliyega jisse aapko channel pe aane wale har video ki instant update sabse pehle mil jayegi basically just uh, just to give you a few more detail about this this is my website on this website if you go down then there is one section which called blue host login so basically you have to go to this article in this article i have explained each step by step guide like why exactly you can create your blue hosting account so basically this is that article in that article i have explained each and everything start from the first point all the offers which bluehost is offering the kind of plans it's offering and how exactly and which plan you should choose for a better experience of bluehost so just go to this article at least once so you will get a better idea about this then you can follow the steps which are given in the article but still in this video i will be explaining the same thing using this video so stay with me this video in this video i will explain each and everything perfectly so basically let's first discuss about bluehost what is bluehost so guys if you are uh, running a website or if you are having any blog or you are currently hosting your website or running any blogger blog so basically your main target to host your website is on some sort of hosting services and bluehost is the best option for you why because bluehost has Bluehost is not a new company. It was established back in year 2000, and it was acquired by company EIG. Basically, EIG is a very big company with name Endurance International Group. This is not only holding a Bluehost, but if you will go to the Wikipedia, on this here you can see like Blue, uh, sorry, EIG is holding this many hosting companies. So it's a big giant, and also providing a good support and customer services to their users. So basically, here I will also talk about the pros and cons to become a part. part of bluehost why people are ignoring bluehost why people are choosing the bluehost with a honest review so that is bluehost and it is acquired by eig basically bluehost is not offering a single kind of hosting service like shared hosting only it has already various types of services like vps cloud hosting and dedicated server hosting so go through this article you will get all the details in this so basically that was the bluehost and now the second thing is we will discussing about why people blame bluehost yes many of i have gone through the number of forums and everywhere i found like the people are some sort of people are blaming to bluehost because of the kind of service they are offering and the first thing for which they are blaming is all about to be a part of eig yes eig is a big company which is very well known for uh, uh for for acquiring a number of hosting companies and that's why the people are thinking like they are not caring about the customer services and they are dropping their support and people are facing a lot many issues while they are having any query or they wanted to resolve that issue so basically here in this video i will tell you a live example which i experienced in my last one or two year there is no such customer support issue people are getting a quite an efficient help from the customer support of bluehost so let's let's do not talk about this let's experience the same thing so let me go to the bluehost and and i will ask for some sort of query and we'll see like how exactly they are responding responding to our query so basically i will go through here the online chatting service so it will pop up this window now here i will type my name and then when click next type anything and type any subject line for the issue you wanted to discuss let's wait it's asking for 5 minute but within a second here you can see like britney has joined and he is ready to help us yes ask the question so here you can start your chatting and i have done this number of times and every time i got instant response and my query got resolved so for this people are blaming to them is this right way or not so basically i feel like this is the best support service provided by blue host hosting service so i hope your doubt is clear with this now the uh, second thing which people are discussing is like blue host is running on old services yes basically it's running on a dedicated server where physical servers are exist 
but if you wanted to go for a cloud service or something then such plans are already available with bluehost so i hope now you are confident enough to start your account with a bluehost so let's head over to the bluehost to do so you will get an additional discount if you'll go through this article the article link which will be given in description box of this video just click to that and on this article there are number of links will be given here you can see there is one link and if you go and scroll down there is another link at this point which you can also click so basically what you have to do is just click to this link it will open in a new window and basically that is an affiliate link so basically you will get here an additional advantage to sign up with this so here you will get an all in around 50% instant discount on your first purchase. So this screen will pop up. Basically before going into depth, I will give you a brief overview the kind of services which Bluehost is offering is all about this. Yes, they have an inbuilt cPanel through that you can one click do installation of your WordPress. That's very easier. Second thing 24 by 7 support of their online chatting services and if you want then you can also make a call to them. Third thing which is more interesting is all about money back guarantee. Yes, they are offering you 30 days money back guarantee. If you want to purchase Bluehost account right now, do that. And within 30 days, if you found any issue, then you will get your money back within 30 days. But there are a few certain terms and conditions. Before that, before buying this, you just have to go through that. So at least you will get an idea was at what exactly and for how long duration you have to buy in a single instant. The last one is free SSL. Yes, basically that is the most advantage thing. If you go for a SSL certificate and then, then definitely you have to pay for some sort of amount. But actually Bluehost is offering you a free HTTPS protocols for all your websites here you can see on screen and that is for complete free you don't have to pay a single penny for this and that is free until you host your website on Bluehost. So that is amazing part. So let's go to the uh, types of hosting services which they are offering basically there are shared hosting cloud hosting vps hosting and dedicated hosting if you are a beginner and just going to be started your uh, website or just wanted to migrate your website which has a decent traffic from another hosting or the blogger platform to the any hosting or wordpress something and definitely you have to go for shared hosting if shared hosting basically it has a single server or a specific servers on which multiple websites will be hosting so here you will get a decent amount of facilities but still this is too good even you can handle a large amount of traffic with the shared hosting the second one is cloud hosting basically that's an advanced one here here not a dedicated server will be allocated for a specific thing basically what happens is based on the traffic if you have a website which has sometimes very instant traffic sometimes not then definitely you go for a cloud hosting because here the server will be auto adjust based on the traffic you are getting so that's an advantage for this next one is vps hosting that's another important thing that if you are getting a of uh, if you are continuously getting a good amount of traffic then you should go for a vps hosting and if you are a business user and already getting a huge amount of traffic then you should definitely go for a dedicated hosting in dedicated hosting a specific server and its specific ram and everything specifications will be allocated to your website so based on your need you can improve and decrease and increase the kind of specification you require for your servers so i hope you are clear with all the types of hosting service and don't worry if you go with any of the hosting service and in future if you wanted to upgrade any of the service then you can just make a call to them do upgrade your plans and you will be easily shifted to the other hosting plans so that's also an advantage so here in this video we'll be discussing about the shared hosting so you don't have to do anything basically after clicking that link you will be navigated to this screen and here you have to click on the get started now so i'm clicking here and we'll go through each and every steps what you have to follow while creating account basically that is a plan for shared hosting for which we are creating this video and there are three plans one is the basic plan second one is plus plan and third one is the choice plan so let me give give you a brief overview about basic plan basically here that is the best important part like the basic plan will will be offered just for 3.95 dollar per month so here in this plan what you can do is you can only host a single website and that single website you can host with this hosting account second thing is website space 50 gb it's good enough if you are having a decent website no need to worry about this so i would suggest like if you don't have any future plan to open another second website then you should definitely go for this basic plan now the second one is website space third one is unlimited yes the bandwidth will be unlimited you can uh, 
you can upload as many as many content as much you want basically there are number of things where you should not care about all these things so here here the main point of focus is all about your one and single website you could host on this service so that is the basic plan now the plus plan this has a little bit advantage that like everything offered by them will be completely unlimited here you can un here you can host around approx 10 websites i think that is what the standard says like around 10 websites you can host on the plus plan that's good enough so if you have any plan to future host any website then you should go for the plus plan and all other things are unlimited other than this here you can also get the marketing offers of 200 which you can use on google or bing wherever you wanted to do the advertisement using this 200 bonus dollar you can do the marketing but don't worry about this basically the same kind of amount is already offered by the google adword or the banks or everywhere so no need to care about this but basically this has unlimited website hosting the choice plan that is recommended for only business peoples or who are getting a large amount of traffic there is one extra additional thing will be given to you that is the domain privacy but don't care about the domain privacy it it doesn't matter basically what it happens like if you will take this one then uh, your who is detail will not be visible to everyone and you can make your privacy but it doesn't matter so the most recommended plans which every person use is plus plan basically it has additional advantage and the great package to purchase from the bluehost so i will go through this plus package only so basically what you have to do is just click to the select button once you click to select button it will navigate to the next window and that window is for sign up so basically there are two things which are the possible cases here the first thing is the new domain and second one is i have a domain name basically if you are a new user who wanted to establish a website and in that case you can here provide your own domain name just in this case i will apply testing this so i am requesting them like i need a domain name with this name and there are uh, some sort of uh, domain names like dot tech or dot blog dot net or dot com whatever the domain name you want you can choose here so if you will click to next it will validate whether this domain is available with this dot com or not if this is available then a free domain for an year will be allocated to you that's the best part bluehost is offering you one year free domain and that one year after one year you have to renew this but till one year it will be completely free so that's a new domain if you wanted to get from this bluehost account that's completely free but let's take an example you already have a website and that website has already some sort of domain which you wanted to migrate to the bluehost so basically that website number like in my case i have my website this so i will type this and simply click to the next button okay so in this case you will get you will not get any domain instantly but the good thing about bluehost is here you can also choose the choose later options basically what happens like if you don't have uh, you do not have any existing website and the second thing is if you haven't decided your actual domain name till date then even they provide you an offer to click on choose letter and just purchase hosting only and decide your domain name later while you while you complete your purchase anytime whenever you want so basically in this case what happens uh, voucher for around 12 dollar will be credited to your account so anytime in future through this bluehost if you will going to purchase any kind of domains then the first buying of domain will be free for you so that's the advantage but here in this case what i will do like i will say like i just need right now a domain and the domain name should be this so basically i will provide this and choose the kind of domain name i want it to so basically here in this case i want com so i choose dot com and then click to next so basically it will navigate to the next window and that will be our final window on which we have to do all the process so the first thing is all about the account information where the basic detail you would have to provide the pin code name business name and everything and the country and everything so that detail you have to provide now the second part is the most important part and that is the package information basically what happens i said like bluehost offer you more discount for the period if, if the longer period you choose you will get the lesser amount you have to pay the lesser amount you will get the highest discount so basically if you will go for a 12 month plan then it will cost you around 7.95 dollar per month for 24 for 36 and 60 so basically it depends on the tenure you wanted to choose if you will go for the 60 months then the costing will around 5.95 dollar but the recommended plan is for the 24 month because that is ideal and that is good to be host on this so basically you can go for a plus 24 month plan 6.95 dollar per month so choose this so this will tell you the total cost how much it will to you so if you have a plan to just host uh, 
for a year only and you wanted to renew this later so the one thing which i would like to alert you is this all discount plan are for the first year only so the first time login you can get this many discount however in later stage after one year you have to renew this and at that moment the 7.95 will cost you around 14 or 15 dollar per month so it's better to go for a 24 month that's what i'm suggest suggesting to you right now but the final decision will be yours only so here in this case i will choose your 6.95 dollar which will cost me all around 166.80 dollar and this will see is like we will give you free SSL certificate so you will get free SSL certificate with your website here you can see HTTPS so it will cost you around $166 now go down and basically there are a few other things if you want then you can add with your package in my case i will not and i recommend you should not because it doesn't require what right now we require is all about the hsl certificate which already bluehost offering you for free of course so basically i have unchecked all the boxes now including everything it will costing me around 166 dollar and just to let you know if you will provide here all the country details and everything this will also add few taxes with this so this will cost you around 171 dollars something and here there are two uh, payment options available if you are able to see only single option then click to this more payment option then another option will be will be enabled so here you can do the payment using paypal and the second thing it only accept the credit card not the debit card so make sure you will provide here the credit credit card detail and the rest you have to check this check boxes and click to submit button once you are done with this, that means you are done with the purchase of the hosting and you are most welcome with the hosting community. Once you will be done with all this thing, then it will navigate to the screen. Here on the screen, you can see like this is my homepage. This is my hosting account, which I'm already hosting my one website. So basically that is my website here, which I'm, which I'm showing you here. So basically that's the process which you have to follow while creating the hosting while creating an account with Bluehost and I assure you there is no issue with this and later on the decision will be of yours only and basically it is owned by EIG so people are blaming them because of the worst services they are offering but I already explained you in the video live how exactly the people are responding to me here you can see the way the people are responding to me uh, I got my answers quickly and and the most important part part is if you have any issue you just ping them they will they will solve your problems on behalf of you so that's all for the today uh, for bluehost uh, registration you can go to the link which is given in the description box just click to that it will navigate to the window and from there you can do all the purchase thank you very much guys for watching this video and i hope you enjoyed a lot and in case of any query you can you can comment me in the description box i will advise you on the way you have to follow while purchasing the other hosting account as well so if you wanted to know more about the host creator then in upcoming days in next two to three days i will be uploading the same videos for host creator as well that's also owned by eig and also offering a vast and better services better services so that's all for the today meet you next video till the time goodbye see you tomorrow.